Hey everybody, today we're going to be using Remedy 3 with a Contact Multi. We'll show you how. So before we start using Remedy 3 or Contact, we want to make sure they're routed to each other. So in FL Studio 21, the way you do that is you have this little plug-in cog wheel symbol here, and then make sure the output port is set to something like 1 or, or something else. 1 for uh, coming out of Remedy 3. And then same icon over on your Contact 7 plug-in here. You go, an input port has to be the same as your output of Remedy 3. So we'll do input port 1. So first thing we're going to do is go to a brand new preset of Remedy 3. We're going to make sure to go into the settings and turn off the internal sound. Then we're going to pick a file. And then zoom in with the preview zoom. And we already have a contact multi set up right here so that my MIDI channel 4 notes go to the bass, the MIDI channel 3 notes go to the guitar, and so on and so forth so that it's split across the MIDI channels. Then you just make sure you choose a slice. Change the speed, maybe even slower. Choose that, maybe get a B section. That could be the B section. Now we got two slices on the pads and you can see the channels one, two, three, four. So the four would be the bass and you can see that that's what the bass is set up to. One last touch you can, you can try. It, it already sounds really cool with the different textures of instruments, but you can go to the strum or the melody tool to spice it up even more. So select the notes once you're in the melody tool. Make sure you're on one beat. In this case, it works well. Min splits zero, max splits, let's try one or two. Randomize. Try again maybe and Pretty cool. See you in the next one.